Where am I going? Oh, oh, here's some gold. Oh! Well, that's our first death. Game over. Save and continue. What? We have to defeat these enemies. What? Except I do have the big key. Oh, right, but I have the big key to unlock doors. Right, I forgot. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Zelda Parallel Worlds. Uh, last time, we got lost and couldn't figure out how to get to Sarah, Sarah Palin, or Sarah Sparilla, whatever his name is. How do you decide if the blank in front of you is a pit? Oh. Well, that works. But we have one bomb left. Crap. Oh. <laughs> and guess what? We're using it right now. Should have probably refilled. I'm gonna need more bombs. Oh, what the? Finally. Sheesh. Yeah, I'm safe staying here. That took way too long. Okay, that's not icy. And we do have the pass key. Matra? Really? I, I don't even think I can damage it. Yeah. I was actually kind of lucky for me to guess it on second try. What? Ah, oh, Or the lamp, rather. Here. Oh, and this is the second boss of the Link to the Past. Even so, not taking that chance. Also, eight rocks uh, got through out of, you know, there. Yeah, we're using the silly master to teleport to the start of the dungeon. Oh, goodness, don't tell me you have to fight again the freaking mid-boss. Yeah. Okay, that's kind of annoying. Go to. I'm just gonna finish this video because I'm getting tired. What? So that's three pieces of hearts for discovering this alternate route into Din's catacombs already. And a fourth piece of heart? Like, really? What the hell? And how does this even make sense? We're in a boat! Like, this, this, is, this is way out of logic and reason now. How do we go from all the way to freaking Lost Woods to somewhere around here and then somewhere here in just a couple of rooms? Like, really? <laughs> yeah, I figured. Really? If I sound different right now, it's because I'm using the old microphone uh, headset. Really? Thank God for the Book of Medora. Are you serious? Actually, I can defuse you with the freaking uh, net, butterfly net. Good that we can still uh, snap those uh, curtains open. Oh, really? <laughs> and it's empty. What? Is that a smiley face? <laughs> and this is a dungeon I've been. Sarah's Gardens. You know what? Let's try it. This is a stupid challenge. Very stupid challenge. Like, what is the- what is- If I didn't have the invincibility cane right here, these things will constantly annoy me while I try to pick up the blocks. Like, really. Um... Time to use the vehicle window up. Cause, uh, we have to do this puzzle every time we come back. Another frustrating puzzle. And this one too. And now, I can't help but feel that something that will annoy me a lot will happen. Can open this door. Yep. Now we have to walk all the way back to the first floor under the freaking uh, 
bridge and press that one switch. Great. Say nothing of the laser beams. But yeah, not not too tough, difficult of a boss. If I had full health and uh, something left. Wait, 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 wait. Time out. What is this too? What? No! Hello everyone, welcome back to Zelda Parallel Worlds. Last time, we went through Saria's garbage. So it opens that door? Really? Well that's kind of pointless, because that's where I came from. Like we have to sp find a spare key, and I'm getting. I'm, it could be from anything. It could be from one of those uh, skulls on the floor, or it could be from the enemies. Yeah, I wonder which block I have to push. Yeah, and that's another thing. All the puzzle amount to all the puzzles in this dungeon amount to just pushing stuff around. Oh, well, that was random. And now we got our spare key. So I heard this is a pretty big dungeon. Okay, that's this boss. Oh, was, was that exciting, guys? Was it? Uh, I'm trying to figure out what the clue is supposed to mean because uh, it's not helping me right now. Never fallen spikes. I'm guessing it's me to, towards there. Yeah, it's probably that's that's probably what it meant. Seriously? Oh, well, I guess we can just fall in the bottomless pit. Oh, great! Don't really know what the point of that uh, transforming thing Jimmy is for. Really? The boss is upstairs, apparently. Mall John, really? What? What the? Well then. Finally. Um, I was warned about a glitch. We are supposed to wait for the floating tiles to finish up. Maybe. Okay. Now it should work. Aha! Hey, there's a hole down here. What the? F Seriously? What the? Seriously? Oh goodness. Go ahead and die, uh, freaking wall jump. I'm gonna watch you die slowly. Um, I'm gonna watch you glitch eternally! Spare key, I guess? Oh. The big chest key. Okay, we can get either of the dungeon items right now. Seriously? I pressed that switch and it, lo and it uncovered something. So I guess I just have to figure it out where it was. Or maybe it's. Or maybe that teleporter is what I have to. Wait. That is vulnerable? Why didn't I know that? Okay, that's. That's legit. I'll accept that. The boss? Seriously? I thought I was going for the treasure. Okay, where does this lead then? Again? Have I not fought you enough times, really? Wait, what? Okay, bomb, 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 bomb. Yeah. 
Oh, thank God it stopped right there. <laughs> that was too close. And that was it, too. Wait, what? Oh, maybe... Hammer? Apparently. Okay, that was kind of weird. I don't know what's with the ra random pigs are where. Okay, finally! And that give, uh, gives us the Bombos medallion. Going through that hard puzzle, getting the mushroom, figuring out I have to throw it in this one fountain to get this item that secretly regenerates your magic much faster than usual. That's all, that's what we all did that for. If we had the magic powder, we would not have been able to get the mushroom, therefore not be able to get the bombos, which we won't be able to get this super fast regeneration. So yeah. Hey everyone, this is Whitehawk. I hope you all enjoyed this compilation of the dumbest moments on my Parallel Worlds playthrough. If you want to understand the context of some of these situations better, then check the link to the playthroughs playlist in the description below, as well as the link to the stupid moments playlist. Most of all though, I hope you've all enjoyed this video, and I hope you all have a very nice day.